we're showing you our extra cab camper. This is probably our most popular camper. It takes a tray of uh, 2100. We can do a two meter one for those who've got a shorter tray, so that's available tray space. We, we do have an 1800 width model, an 1850 width model, and a 1900 width model. Um, and we do sometimes do different versions, custom builds of that. Our standard model looks a little bit like this, and this one's got a few options which I'll talk about as we go. So it has a Knoll's drop down slide, which is great for accessing. This is the ARB fridge, but there are other fridges that fit in there. We actually like the Waco because it opens this way and you don't have to hold it up, but we can do a clip if you like this style fridge. Uh, about 47, 49 litre, depending on the brand fridge that you have. So it, it allows you to look into the fridge, uh, but still takes minimal space, which is when Noel designed this camper over 10, 10 years ago now, he uh, had that in mind, optimal space, ease and comfort. So. He designed these drawers specifically for me because I had a bad back and I was sick of boxes. So everything is here, nice solid aluminium drawer, compartmentalised, nice and deep at the back for some pantry goods. They will last you a lifetime of your camper. And a bench here for your preparation. This drawer here is an optional second drawer and I use that for lots of snacks at the back and more not so used pantry items in here. Over on this side is the second drawer which does come as standard and you can see this is deep all the way so we often use that as our pot drawer. It holds our billies and our pots and colanders um, obviously this isn't full, we've just got a couple of things in here to show you. Great space, you know, for your own things. You know, we think it's really important to design a camper that's not just um, drawers and spaces all taken up, that you have spaces to put your own things that you want. Now, when we were going to come to AgFest today, we were going to show you our new kitchen design. And we're going to show it to you any, anyway. Those who were there the last few years knew that this came out this way. We have now designed our kitchen to come out this way. Same design with our tub in here, drainer here. Just a little bit more access for if someone's here and someone can be there to do the dishes. It's also got what I've been asking Noel for for a little while is a tea towel holder. Uh, our two burner Smev stove, Smev stove is the same. Um, still space in here for bits and pieces, but a new little condiment rack here. Uh, and uh, this is our space here with an optional travel buddy if you'd like to have some nice home cooked meals in, in your oven. So that's pretty much the design of the fridge. Uh, I'll just show you the electronics here. So this is the um, Voltronic uh, water mo monitor. So if we turn that on, it'll show, it'll display how much water is in the tank. The 75 litre water tank, uh, this is obviously empty. There's the filler for that here, a quick and easy filler and the merit plug and the accessory plug also come as standard. If you like, you can opt for the battery uh, monitor here and Noel will later show you a little bit more about that. And there's the, the water drainer here, tucked in on the side. On the roof here, you'll see some lighting. And if you like, you can have some external lighting as well. And if Julie just takes a step back, our wonderful photographer, you can see our awning 
on this camper. Now this is an optional, what we call a quick awning. And on the other camper next door, which we'll show you later on, is the standard awning that comes with every camper. If you want to just turn around, Julie, and show that. That comes with every every camper. We'll probably do a demo on that that also for you, so you can see the pack up of that. So thanks, thanks for coming and seeing our first video, and uh, Noel will show you around on the other side uh, shortly.